Folks, good morning and welcome to Integrity Cells. We're going to start right off here on the front of this brand new 2011 Integrity Hopper trailer. Folks, what we're looking at is one here that's equipped with a Sherlock electric roll tarp system, and we'll get you the demonstration later. What we're going to do for right now is slowly take you along the side and let you see our quality, time-tested design, stamped rib style trailer. We're going to move on down slow so you can get a very good view of how this trailer is built and constructed with all solid welded construction. You can see this trailer is equipped with side windows. We have two individual hoppers. We have a lift axle and three in a row in the back. This is a Michigan special. Okay, now let me show you here, folks. This is a really nice landing set gear. It's got the two speeds, so you can go in and out. Um, you can uh, put this trailer down loaded, and, these, and this is built that this will take this. Uh, it's got, the, as I said, the two-speed uh, uh, deal to go fast and slow, so you can, you can do that in that way. Now let's flip on over here. I'm going to show you our time-tested door design. This thing is really nice. You can crank, if you can't crank this, uh, uh, this has no gearbox. Um, this is our time-tested design. It really cranks nice. I'm going to give you a nice demonstration. As just look at it spin. Look at that sucker spin. It's just really, really nice. Uh, and I can also spin it back the same way. Okay, folks, with that, let's move on back. And Dave's going to open the compartment that houses the lift axle controls. They are cab-operated, electric over air, so you never have to get out of the truck to make these lift axle controls function. If you take a look here, you can see it's simply air over, electric over air, and it's controlled with a toggle switch from the cab, air up and air down. With that, let's continue on toward the back of the trailer. As you can see, when we walk along the side, again, very nice, solid side solid welded construction to prevent cracking and failure. With that, I'm going to let you have a look inside the side windows. You can see into the trailer, down into the hopper area, looking in from outside. With that, folks, let's move on back to the suspension area. You can see how the suspensions turn out. This particular trailer is built on a rebuilt air ride triaxle suspension. And you can see, folks, we have the solid floor panels over the wheels all the way from the front to the back under the suspension. Folks, this is the secret to longevity. You can see the mud that's splattered up on these panels already. Guess what, folks? Where would that mud be if the floors weren't there? We all know the answer. It'd be up inside the trailer trying to kill it from day one. All right, folks, let's take a nice look at the back of the trailer. Because of the triaxle, we have a two-foot slope on the back wall so that we don't end up with a flat spot up on the top. And I'm going to climb up on the trailer and show you that. Let's go ahead and climb up the ladder. Okay, folks, popping up over the top rail, you can see, again, our time-tested design tarp bow system where we have absolutely built our bows like trusses. So they're built in here unlike typical bows that just shed water. The bottom strength tube on there is what is really a factor in keeping the trailer top rails together. And here again you can see looking down the slope we enjoy very steep slope degree angles. They're going to clean out for you no problem. With that I'm going to get back down off the trailer and we'll continue with the video. Let's get a nice square look at the back of the trailer, folks. Next, you can see it, it turns out very nice. It has eye appeal, and again, the quality is second to none. Let's come on around and continue on up the passenger side of the trailer. As we move forward, you can see the electric tarp is in its open position at this moment. And as we get around to the front, we're going to go ahead and give you a nice demonstration of that rolling shut. And before I get to the front, I want to take a moment and let you see the floors over the wheels above the front tires. As you can see, folks, looking along the hopper area, you can see that they are also all solid welded construction, and you can see the solid floor panels over the wheels and under the entire front to keep all that crap from going up on top of your fifth wheel and rusting out your trailer. We do have a removable manhole cover so that you can access it for wiring and whatever else needs you may have in the future. With that, I'm coming on around to the front, and we're going to go ahead and focus here and let Dave show you the remote. I'm going to show you the remote. I'm going to let you get right up here and see it. As you can see, it's a Sherco right there. I'm going to open it up. It just has a real simple open and close. And all we're going to do is we're going to take it right up there, and I'm going to go ahead and just hit close. And watch that sucker move real fast. Boy, I can, I can walk away. I can do this from the cab. I can walk over here. Uh, I'm just walking away from the camera there, and you can see it's just going out just perfect. Now let's walk on around to the other side, and we can watch it as it slips on down. All right, now as it comes back down here to the bottom, you can see it just moves over uh, flawlessly. It doesn't skip or whatever. Uh, it trails real good with the front and back. 
uh, it, it comes right on down. As you can see, it's, it's reversing and then going back up, so that's how it locks up in there. You just bring it right up until it's tight, and that is it. Wow, folks, did you check that out? Very, very nice feature. Now, you may wonder, how reliable is this system? Well, I'm going to tell you how reliable it is. We have never had a remote failure short of a battery, and in that event, you come up here to the front of the trailer, and you actually have a hardwired switch that I can run it open and close right here from the front of the trailer mounted where it's easy accessible right here beside the driver's door so folks with that we're going to go ahead and wrap up this video by telling you thank you very much for shopping integrity cells and services hey and give us a call at 260-238-5000 and visit our website at www.99trailers.com and also www.99trucks.com Thanks for watching our time-tested design. Uh, we will build to your specifications, whatever you want. We we'll look forward to doing business with you. Thanks so much. And folks, don't forget, we also sell very, very nice day cabs with our hopper trailers. Here is a prime example of that, 2005 Freightliner. So if you're in, in the need of a complete package, don't hesitate to give us a call. We would love to fulfill your needs.